To France and the government has survived the first of two no-confidence votes in reaction to its controversial pension reform, which proposes to raise the retirement age from 62 to 64. A successful vote would have forced the Prime Minister to resign. The retirement age will now rise from 62 to 64. That's amid backlash from French politicians. The reality is that in any case they are in an absolute deadlock and the fate of Madame Elizabeth Bourne and her government is very largely put into question today because we're no longer progressing. Who does the government wish to hear from? The unions? No, they don't. The people's voice? They don't wish to. And who is here to rescue the government? No one. And so the reality is that we're in a deadlock and the only way to get out of this is through the withdrawal of the bill. The proposal has sparked protests across the nation as angry citizens light up fires and attack police as well. No one really protests like the French do, that's for sure. MPs in favour of the bill have even received death threats.